Hey, what's up, everyone? My name is Jordan Best. I'm here in the studio of Ashley Ingram, the Ivor Novello award-winning producer. Credits with Mariah, Destiny's Child, Desiree. The list goes on of wicked singers because that's what we do here in Ashley's studio. Vocals. So today we're going to talk about Veal Clang. The new VK2 just dropped, and trust me, it's wicked. If you don't know about Veal Clang, instant harmony generation is really sweet. You got to check it out. But it does more than just that. So we're going to go a little deeper today, and we're going to show you how Ashley and his team uses Veal Clang 2, VK. Let's get into it. Yes, so here we are in Logic Pro, and we're looking at the VK2 plugin window. I have a vocal in here you can see in yellow, so let's go ahead and take a listen to the track. <laughs> I keep falling into this dream I can't wake you up If I fall into this sleep I don't know what I've become From a broken heart Will I ever budge? Okay, so you know what? I love the vocal energy of this singer But if you noticed in the beginning Let's go back to the beginning of the vocal. There were a few funky notes. So let's play those again. I keep falling into this dream. Yeah, there we can hear a few pitch problems. So let's take a look at what VK can do. I keep falling. All right, so I'm going to touch this note here. It is sharp. If I hit E, I'm going to get these edit controls. This is where VK can do anything. If you imagine you want to modify a note like that, whatever's in your head, trust me, VK can do it. So this one's a little sharp. Let's just pull it into the note there. Let's play that. I keep fall. Much better. And this guy too is sharp. So let's pull him down. Another way you can do it, you can see it sitting a little sharp here because on the side you have your piano roll. So of course the yellow vocal and the white line is representing the journey of the pitch and the journey of the vocal. So another way to tune it, I'm going to simply right click and you'll see it pop down into the note. Let's listen again. I keep fall. Much better. That's in tune now. Let's keep listening. I keep falling into this dream. Okay, now that we fixed those parts. I keep falling into this dream. I this part here needs attention as well. So let's see what we can do. We're gonna double click and we zoom right in, makes it easier to edit. I'm gonna hit C for cut and I get this knife. I'm going to cut this note. Actually, it's two notes. That's why I'm going to cut it. Let's zoom back out. Now you can see the two separate notes. We're going to tune them separately. Um, I think they're really sharp. Let's listen again. Into this dream. Yeah, so let's just drag them both down. They're both a semitone out. Let's drag them down. <laughs> And I didn't hold option that time, so it just snapped right into the next note. Let's listen to that. Into this dream. Better. Those two are better. But now I can hear this guy needs to come. There we go. Let's listen to that now from the beginning. I keep falling into this dream. I can't. Much better. Now we're in tune. VK, so quick to get your vocal melody in the right place. Let's see what else we can do here. This dream, I can't wake you. I can't. This note here, can't. It's a little bit plain. So let's show off a little bit what VK can really do. 
All right, I'm going to zoom in. So E gives you the edit. And before I tuned it, this time I'm going to drift it, which means I'm going to steady the note out. And I'm going to pull it straight. As you can see, the white line is straight. Let's listen to that. I can't pretty natural if you guys are familiar with some other softwares out there you can't pull it as much as VK I'm just telling you VK2 is more powerful than Melodyne the engine is more powerful than Celemony and Autotune as well the way you can dive into your vocal the way you can use all of these controls it's really powerful so now that I straightened it, what I'm going to do is I'm going to hit V. Remember, E for edit. V gives me my vibrato designer, which is just wicked. I'm going to pull this back, and you can see the cycles forming, and I can raise the amplitude. You see the vibrato there. Let's take a listen. To this dream. I can't wake you up. Hear that? Pretty natural. Maybe a little bit too much. So let's adjust it. Can't, can't wake I like that. So let's play it. Falling into this dream. I can't wake you up. Adds a little emotion there. And you know what? Wake you up. Let's do the same thing there. So let me play that for you. Can't wake you up. So we hear up and we're gonna cut this off. So let me touch it. The C gives me my blade. I'm gonna cut it. And now this note here. Um, before we do vibrato, I find it's it's better to pull this straight. Pull it straight. So when you do the vibrato, you're working with a clean slate so to speak. Let's take a listen to that. Can't wake you up in Ooh, a little bit of tension there. I like that. Let's listen from the beginning. I keep falling into this dream. I can't wake you up if I Yeah, I like that. Can't wake you up if I fall into this sleep. I Ooh. Another off note there, sleep. So let's zoom in. What are we listening to here? I fall into this sleep. Ooh, yes, sharp. So sharp and it kind of slides up. So what we can do is, um, not the vibrato, go back to the editor. Uh, remember I pulled the drift before. What I'm gonna do now is, I'm gonna select just this location to move the drift. So I'm going to pull that up. Um, now let's listen. I fall into this sleep. I now the note's more even, but it's still sharp. So now we can just simply right click. It snaps right into the note. I fall into this sleep. I don't know what I'm... Let's take a listen from the beginning. You remember what it sounded like before? I keep falling into this dream I can't wake you up If I fall into this sleep I don't I keep falling into this dream I can't wake you up If I fall into this sleep I don't sounding much better so as you can see I just dove in a little bit the drift control the volume control being able to cut and split your notes and the vibrato designer VK is so powerful so crazy and quick to get your vocals really rocking accurately get your pitch in order get your timing in order and then you can have fun building the rest of the tracks and of course get into some harmony. I couldn't harmonize if the lead vocal was out of tune. So now let's take a look at some of the harmonies that VK can do.